texture, this portion originally pertains to the shield of the captain model, but for this one, we're going to use it as the um, texture for the pauldrons. So we're gonna adjust it as such. Okay, so let's take a look. Save changes then save. Now let's take a look at it, how it looks like. Okay, so nice. Kind of resembles like the one in the King Arthur's model. So we're gonna leave it at that for now. Okay, so let's go back to dummy. Pauldron is done, so get rid of it. Okay, so let's hmm. Let's go for the basically let's go for the sides of the pauldron. So basically this area. Because it's uh, again it's basically see this the side of the pauldron. We're going to bring it back to the um original model or rather the new model rather so let's delete it let's save it so instead of pauldron team color let's save it as pauldron save now if you open it so this is the portion yes this is the side of the pauldron so we're going to bring it back to the new model right silver hand Okay, again double check. Knight silver hand. There. We're going to add the uh, different pieces of armor later successively. Okay, so for now, we're only going to bring back the original portions of the armor. But for the ones where we uh, change the textures, we're going to add them later. Okay. So go back to the main. We can now delete the um, sides of the pauldrons. Okay, so I wonder um, which part do we edit next? Hmm, let's go for the um, boots. Oh, let's go for the boots because um, if you go to my Arthas model. It actually shares the same texture as the pauldrons or rather the front part of the boots as you can see here if you hold control and press left click you will notice in my Arthas models that the um, pauldrons belong to the same geo set as the uh, as the mesh of the um, front portion of the shoes so what we're going to do is we're going to take it and then I'm gonna chop it then save it again hmm let's save it as a shoes shoes I guess um, so I only want the front portion so how do I do that? Hmm. Hmm. I'm gonna do a bit of a trick here that I've been doing, but basically what I'm gonna end up with is only the front portion of the shoes so basically save okay so basically now i'm stuck only with the front portion of the shoes now to rewrap it 
um, okay so basically this is the shoe part and this is the place where I want to wrap it hmm okay so there I'm going to put it here then wrap it here okay <coughs> excuse me Okay. Let's hmm. So save. Okay, since the shoes share the same um, texture as the pauldron, we can combine them. So, pauldron, team color, merge geoset, shoes. Okay. Now, if we look at it. Pauldron, team color. Okay. See there. So, kind of resembles the one with my King Arthas mod. And basically... It's the same um, shoe texture for the captain model as well. Okay, next. What we're gonna do is... Hmm. We can now go... We can actually delete this. Okay, let's go back to dummy. Now let's go for the rest of the shoes. So let's go back here. So this time we no longer need the front portion because we've already done it. Now save it as shoe. Now if we open shoes, so we what we have is the um, f uh, back portion and the sole now first things first um it also uses the texture of the captain but this time it's not team color so basically let's just replace it with from the knight let's replace it with the captain and then we're going to make adjustments shoes Okay, for the um, for the back portion of the shoes, yeah, this one. Uh, the, let's separate it from the soles. Okay, we'll go back to the soles later. Okay, so this is this portion represents the back of the shoes of the captain model. Okay. We can adjust it. Hmm. Okay, then save. Now for the um, soul portion, I'm gonna do another trick here. Hard to explain, but basically. Oof. Anyways. I'm gonna have to save the souls. Okay, let's go for soul.mdl. What I'm going to do is I'm going to chop up the triangle representing the soul so I can wrap it better with the texture. So basically. Whoops. Now let's merge it.
Okay. Now if we go back to Rappi, this is for the remember this is for the souls. Um go for top remap. So as you can see here. No. Hmm. Let's go for this portion. Um, so this is a mirror image, so let's go here, and then let's put it here, Okay, so let's take a peek how it looks like. So, okay, so not bad. Let's combine it with the shoes from before. So let's delete, delete the original soles, add the soul, and then save. And then open up the shoes. Okay. Again, yeah, not bad. Okay, so we're basically done with the shoes. You can delete it from the dummy model. Now, let's go for the neck. Now, as you can see here, the neck shares the same texture as the shoes so might as well include it okay so first let's delete the sole <coughs> so so we have the shoes pauldron team call and then the dummy let's go for the neck next dummy let's take the neck portion and then save it as neck Okay, so now we have the neck. Hmm, so basically, for my King Arthur's model, the neck portion uses the helmet portion of the texture. So basically, left. And then orient it as this. Rotate, rotate, rotate. And then what we're going to do is we're going to take this portion. <coughs> Excuse me. Okay. So this is the portion of the neck. So. And then save again you can save again and then uh, save so let's save this neck. go back to shoes then merge it with the neck and then open back in magos model editor and shoe. so let's see now it resembles that of the uh, King Arthur's model. Okay, so you can delete the neck. And then if you go back to the MDL vertex modifier, you can delete the neck from the dummy. Okay, save. Now, for the dummy model, well, the rest of the body if you notice for my king artist model most of the body uses the um user texture so basically we might as well replace it now so go to let's just the color uh team colored version so replaceable id1 unshaded put it on top and then for the uh texture below use outer and then use blend okay okay 
Hmm. Okay, so uh, I'm gonna take a break for a while. Okay, then we'll resume immediately. <laughs> 